what is up guys welcome to another uh cleaning vlog so today we're going to be doing a uh, roof wash um house wash and also cleaning around the pool deck sorry if you guys can't see me turn away from the sun but yeah so that's what we got going on i'll show you guys the job in a second i gotta watch my step because i have a dog apparently and there's some uh poop around so let me go ahead and give you guys a little view of the, what we got going on Alrighty, so you can see a little bit of the house. House isn't too big. So nothing too crazy over here. The roof shouldn't be that long of a job. As you can see over here, we got some mold action going on. This is probably the dirty side of the house. Um, because the little fence is right there, it's only going to take me a couple seconds. I'm going to just throw that in, even though I didn't charge them for it. But sometimes, you know, just throwing little bonuses for your customer. So I'm going to go ahead and clean that because that won't really be any extra work on my behalf, really. Um, so, yeah, and I got some, I'm going to get you guys some cool footage. I'm using my drone today. So we're going to get some drone uh, view of the roof, which is going to be pretty dope. And I'll walk around back and um, show you guys everything we got going on. And also, part of this video is going to act as, uh, so when you first get to a job, you always want to do what I call a property protection walk around. My boy Steven right here, dropping off my wallet at LF. Say what's up to the vlog. What's up, my boy? <laughs> I gotta run though. Alright man, appreciate it. Alright man, no problem. Alright, so we gotta clean this garage too. All right, so you always want to get stuff like this. You can see that's damaged. I don't know what this is. That's probably gonna come out though. We got damage here, you know, so cover yourself. You know, not everyone is gonna try to get over on you, but you do wanna make sure you at least take that precaution because you never know, right? You never know what might happen when it comes to uh, you know you doing your job and stuff, you can see the roof right there is pretty dirty. Like I said, this roof is easily walkable. Uh, we got to clean around this pool deck, and so for this, we're not really going to be using a whole lot of pressure. We're really going to soft wash around this pool deck, and that's going to do most of the work. So yeah, all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and set up and uh, get started. guys so i'm all set up got my ladder all my hoses pulled out uh just fill, finish up filling up the tank so we're gonna go ahead and knock this roof wash out um i'm gonna put my ppe on so wearing my glasses my gloves uh respirator um so always you know think about safety don't want to just be inhaling this stuff in and like i said i'm gonna get you guys some more dope footage of the uh with the drone as i spray um so yeah let's go ahead and knock out the roof first and then we'll finish everything else let's do it
All right, guys, so the roof is all done. It looks a whole lot better. Um, and before I show you guys the footage, the after footage of the, of the roof, I just wanna give you guys a little uh, pro tip. If you spray the roof, right, and after you spray it and sat there, you know, it's done its thing, if you still see, if it still looks dark, those dark lines or dark spots, that means you need to reapplicate, right? Um, this little saying, if it's brown coming down, normally you're good, right? So light brown lines are good. Those will rinse away in the rainfall. So be sure just to, if you see the dark areas or it still looks dark, that don't double question yourself or second guess yourself. You literally just need to reapplicate. And when it comes to your ratio, uh, when it comes to washing the roof, uh, I'll get some flack for this, but I like to go hot. I like to go 6%, throw some lava on there. Guys are gonna be like, oh, you don't need that hot. It really just depends on how dirty the roof is. This roof was pretty dark. And I can guarantee you that you know anything less than like five percent is gonna take double coats you know and I, I just don't feel like what's the point of doing a bunch of double coats than doing one solid you know good coat but anyway to each his own uh you know whatever works for you whatever floats your boat really it's like the sh is gonna do no d damage to the uh shingles really it's just a matter of you as a business owner that you're gonna spend a little bit more money on chemicals but who cares if you built if you've charged correctly then you're good to go anyway guys let's cue the epic drone footage of the after uh, of the wash. <laughs>